day for that baby girl who was shot in the face this week and is now recovering in the hospital. We want to take you to that vigil where the mayor just wrapped up speaking and the family of the victim. They have been speaking as well. Let's listen in. Our quality of life, it is not acceptable. We are thankful to have our state senator here. want to recognize Senator Gustavo Rivera. Good evening. I want to say three things. Number one, we are here to support the family and the community. Number two, accountability. As the DA said and as the police department has said, we will identify the person that did this because anybody who does something like this needs to be held accountable. But then comes number three. And number three is us asking ourselves, why do things like this continue to happen? We must, we must, we must make sure that this does not happen. Our borough president said it. Let's make sure that we provide the resources so that young people do not see it as an option to come out shooting in these streets without caring for families or communities. So one, we support the families and the community. Number two, we hold those who do, don't, who do things like this accountable. But number three, let's not forget that we must, we must, we must make sure this does not happen again. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Senator. So you've actually just been listening in to a rally that's happening with uh, UC Borough President Vanessa Gibson there and other uh, local elected officials speaking. Um, also, we've heard that the family of the baby that was shot in the face this week, they're all there for that vigil tonight. We're going to have more on the story coming up later here on News 12. Well, let's get